Hey guys, it's Caitlin, and today I'm going to show you how you can make your own watermelon juice without using a juicer. So for this recipe, you're going to need a blender and a mason jar, as well as a large bowl and some type of fine strainer. I have a metal one, and finally some fresh watermelon. So this is super simple. You're just going to fill your blender up with the fresh watermelon pieces and then attach the lid and blend. And the watermelon has enough liquid in it where you can just blend it by itself and it will form a juice type consistency. Then you're just going to pour this juice through the strainer into your large bowl to separate the fiber of the watermelon from the watermelon juice. And you're just going to repeat this process until you've used up all of your watermelon. If you have a bigger blender, you could probably do this in one step, but I only have this smaller one, so I have to do it a few times. Then you're going to stir the remaining juice and pulp that's left in the strainer because this helps get the remaining liquid out. And you'll have to stir for a while and you may even want to mash the pulp into the strainer to get more juice out. But at the end you'll just be left with a thick pink mush that's basically the watermelon fiber and a few seeds. So just throw that out and then open your mason jar and pour the remaining juice in. And this is actually a good recipe to do if you have a bad watermelon so you don't have to eat the mushy watermelon texture but you can still make delicious and sweet watermelon juice. Then all you have to do is pop in a straw and you're all set. If you want to get extra fancy, I like adding fresh lime juice to mine or you could also blend in fresh mint as well. But that's it guys, it's super simple and I hope you try it because it's so delicious. Thanks for watching.